Hi Cancer, it's Elle here to do your mid-March monthly general reading. This is the general energy, what's going on with you. Um, I did do another Cancer reading, but I took it down because um, ooh, it wasn't good, number one. Uh, and then number two, I, I shot it in the wrong um, layout. Wow, this, this just keeps coming out for you guys. Uh, so yeah, I took it down. So here we go. We're hoping that this is better. Uh, Ten of Swords. Somebody's done. Somebody's done and finished. Uh, you might have been felt backstabbed, blindsided, backed into a corner, just had the wind knocked out of you by way of some information. Um, you're mentally exhausted here. You can take no more. It's the ending of something here with the Ten of Swords. Could be dealing with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is Cancer, love. We're going to do love. What are the love messages for Cancer? Nine of Wands. Yeah, it's making you very um, standoffish. You're evaluating the situation from afar. From afar is, you know, you... you you removed yourself mentally or physically or physically mentally or mentally physically or emotionally you're trying to have strength in dealing with this this betrayal uh either to cancer or coming from cancer so you could be you could have betrayed someone else if someone betrayed you could be possible fire sign air sign leo in particular Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. All right, you're having strength to get through this. Um, also, you're trying to tame yourself from not flying off the handle. Five of Pentacles. But whatever this is, um, whether it's the information coming out and you, I'm sorry, something's on my nails, guys. Hang on. Um. Whether it's now or it's to come, we have the Five of Pentacles. Someone's feeling lack, lack of self-esteem, lack of lack of self-worth due to the fact that somebody may have backstabbed you. Just the ultimate betrayal, and this is in love, so you're feeling left out. <clears throat> yeah an earth sign to be significant let's not get too wrapped up in the signs let's just, just kind of you know go with the energy yeah it takes you to the hermit status you could be dealing with the Virgo but this energy just moves you to the hermit status in the sense of, you know, um, you need to have some self-reflection. You need to be introspective about what's the next move. Maybe with a Sagittarius. Or you're needing to find find balance again. There's no balance here. You're I, Right, you're trying to tame yourself uh, emotionally, physically, mentally. There's no balance here. She has the infinity symbol over her, over her mind, over her head, over her thoughts. Um, positivity, the ebb and flow. Let it, yeah, you're trying to tame yourself here. You're trying to find balance again in this relationship. Right, because the three of swords is here. This may be divorce, separation, caution in relationship due to infidelity. Here's you, King of Cups, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Could be dealing with another water sign. Either the betrayal and then the heartbreak was perpetrated against you or, or vice versa. But things are moving rapidly. 
the, the Eight of Wands in regards to the Six of Cups, in regards to a soulmate from your past, or someone who you are showing love to. Five of Cups, Six of Cups, Five of Cups, it just reduces. It's almost as if Cancer is trying to get themselves out of a third-party situation. They're grieving the loss here. Right. Then the lovers, you could be dealing with the Gemini. You do have swords here. Mm -hmm. Grieving the third-party situation. Grieving the loss of. But understanding that there's love elsewhere. Wow. And then the chariot card. You, Cancer, there's elsewhere. There's love elsewhere. Or there's love for self. Or you'll have victory in this movement away from relationship or uh, hurt, hurt and pain here. It's positive movement forward, but it's alone. The chariot carries one. The chariot is not, as I always say, it's not a stagecoach. It's for one person. Move yourself ahead. Move yourself along. Move forward. King of Swords, you may need to be like the King of Swords and be very decisive. Decisive against the Empress. Someone who you deem as creative, beautiful, beautiful, You know, another way I'm reading this is here's you, Cancer. Here's your partner. Here's the other person. It's nothing but secrets and lies. Under the moon, under the dark, something is in the dark. It needs to be hidden. Five of Wands, pettiness, arguing. Ace of Pentacle, but there's a new beginning, a new foundational beginning. I don't know if the partner's trying to build with the other, the other party. But the Six of Swords is here. Somebody's moving away from them. And this is Air Sign. Eight of Swords. But feeling trapped and stuck. We'll pull two more. Yeah, Three of Wands. Ten of Cups. It looks like for a partner, honestly, guys, I'm speaking to the Cancers who have had betrayal perpetrated to them. Um, it looks like a partner is trying to move away from and find their happiness or they have found happiness elsewhere and they're just waiting for the opportunity to actually physically mentally emotionally spiritually like clear move and you have to go through the emotions of of being left behind and then it could be vice versa you know cancer you're leaving someone else behind all right <sighs> you know this is the spring springtime is coming spring equinox this is the month of, of three the third month divinity Things having divine timing, the Trinity, holiness. It's time to to move forward. Let things happen as they will. Thank you for the messages for cancer and career and finance. Career and finance. Let's give some messages for cancer and career and finance. Career and finance. Three of Swords. Wow. It might be a separation from a job, too, uh, or a way of making money. It might be bittersweet. Wow, okay. But you, you feel kind of stuck. Like I said, it's bittersweet. You feel trapped to it. You know, it's like I've been here. Maybe it's a situation of I've been at this job for X amount of years, and, you know, I love the people, and I love what I do, but there's more for me elsewhere on the horizon and I'm waiting for it. Seven of Swords. 
you may have you may have you may be making this transition to other other job other way of making money other whatever in secret you may have you know been very sneaky and sly about you know moving forward to to other in your career sector with the seven of swords here um you're just taking your talents your efforts your skills and you know you're going elsewhere with it two of swords yeah you had a decision to make maybe you've received the offer the father pinnacle yeah you gotta you gotta leave something behind you've received the offer they're moving fast toward you knight of wands you know maybe this company wants you to start quickly you want to have time to rectify things strength card um you're trying whoa 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 you're trying to have strength in dealing with uh having to make a decision to move elsewhere in your career sector let's see right three of wands four of wands just stability for you elsewhere i feel like it, it might even be more money knight of cups and then look how the knight of cups and the knight of wands are facing each other this offer may have come in very swiftly they want you to make a decision a decision act on this quickly and it looks like it might be something that is emotionally fulfilling and it's an offer that you're going to um meet head on with the four ones um it's going to offer you a new level of stability all right i'm going to shuffle one more time we're going to get what's on the bottom of the deck thank you thank you thank you for the messages for career and finance career and finance looks pretty good it looks like you're you're finally going to move to something you want to do four pinnacle nice so it reduces from the five to the four to the point where uh sometimes this is People want to hold on to status to nine of swords. Yeah, wow. These cards do not lie. Okay, so four of pinnacle, nine of swords, ace of pinnacle, new job, new business, new way of making money, big purchase, uh, just solidifying um, income and income status you know uh wow nice this is really nice you're trying to hold on to your status here with this job or this position but the universe has something even better for you some of you are receiving a large payout to you don't know what to do with the money. Because the hangman is here. You don't know what to do with it. You don't know what to do with this job offer either. Um, you have to get a personal reading as to know if you should take it or not. It looks like you should take it though. Um, it looks like you, you... You know, I just give the advice. Leave every situation on a good note. So if you leave your current company, you know, in good standing, if you ever need to come back, if you ever need to reach out, you know, of course, they'll be receptive to that because you left on, on good terms and good standing. And, um, hey, it happens. I've gone back to the same company twice. Yeah. Resign once. Resign twice. Yeah. It went back. Yeah, so, I mean, you know, it's just about how you do things. Like I said, you can do anything. You can say anything. It's just the manner how you do it and the manner how you say it. All right. Home and family life. Home and family life. What is home and family life like for cancer? Home and family. Home and family. Home and family. Home and family for cancer. What is home and family life like? 
What's going on for Cancer for home and family? True, accurate messages of love and light. All right. All right. Thank you, thank you, thank you for the messages for Cancer, home and family. Okay. Queen of Wands, Ace of Cups, the Moon, home and family. Someone's been very uh, listening to their intuition here, trying to get a little bit more spiritual. There's some things you don't know. Spirit may be working behind the scenes. You might be with a fire sign. If not, you're just taking on an energy of, you know, of action. Page of Pentacle. Messages of stability. Maybe um, let's see, Eight of Wands, Knight of Cups. Six of Cups. Hmm. Where's this going? Knight of Swords. Lord. And this, and then the Tower, and then the Three of Swords. So it looks kind of like our love reading in home and family. And it just looks like there's some things working behind the scenes. This might be spirit working with you or your partner there are messages of stability elsewhere the page of pentacles is looking away from the reading the knight of cups is looking away from the reading the knight of swords is is going the other way too you could be with a an air sign fire we've got everybody here well yeah we've got air and fire and water too could be pisces There's going to be a shake-up. Things are moving behind the scenes spiritually to, wow, then the Queen of Swords. Some of you could be dealing, this is my Gemini card. Some of you could be dealing with the Gemini. It could be Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. The Queen of Swords is on the bottom of the deck. And then the Knight of Swords. Some of you definitely dealing with an air sign. An air sign that is hostile, mad, upset, frustrated. There are messages of stability elsewhere. Met arrows of love. And then the Knight of Cups right after it. Sometimes this is Aquarius. Aquarius is trying to give love to maybe a soulmate. Someone who they deem as a soulmate from the past. This is my other woman card, too. Queen of Wands. Very seductive. Beautiful. Charismatic. Mm, I don't know, guys. I don't know. Y'all get in the comments and let me know. It looks like somebody is trying to move away from home. Home and family. And um, the spirit, spirit is going to bring down the tower so that this separation, this divorce can happen. Else, else it wouldn't happen, you know unless spirit came in and pushed it along because somebody is holding on and someone else is trying to move away from all right let's do some messages of uh support and guidance thank you for the messages it's the butterfly oracle Cards by Doreen Virtue. Thank you for messages of support and guidance for Cancer for March 20, mid March 2018, going into April. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for the messages for Cancer. True, accurate messages for Cancer. Cancer. Messages of support and guidance for Cancer. Support and guidance. We need it. We need your support and guidance. Almighty one. All knowing. All right. You are stronger than you know. The strength card came out, I think, in two spreads, right? You are stronger than you know. It's pretty self explanatory. I, I've got the deck upside down, guys, and I don't read these cards upside down. Windfall. And I think I said that in one of the spreads. I think 
in the career and finance, some of you have or are receiving a large sum of money, you don't know what to do with, or just a really good windfall of positive energy. Uh, so it could be either or. That looks really good for you, though. Okay. Take the next step. It looks like some of you were hesitating to take the next step now because uh, you didn't know what to do. You put yourself at the hangman status. It's like you know what to do, but uh, it's volunteer. It's so much easier to do nothing. You know, not making a choice or not doing anything is doing something. You chose to not do anything or not say anything, not move. Volunteer. Volunteer at this time because it looks like you guys are getting some good energy and you want to disperse that energy into the universe so it can come back even tenfold for you. Not only that, um, some of you are going through some tough times. Volunteer to displace that negative energy, that neg those negative thoughts, those thoughts of less than. Um, if you get around some people who are actually less than or have less than you, um, then you'll start to transform those thoughts that, hey, life is not that bad, is it? Uh, you know, we all have to go through that. So anyway, I hope that this reading resonated with you guys. If it did, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel, follow me on InstaGo. My handles are below. Uh, follow me on Instagram. Choose to fund the page by clicking the GoFundMe link. Take advantage of the $30, 30-minute readings. Uh, remember cancer, when in doubt, pray. I'm praying for you guys. Pray for me as well. Take care.